Good morning, sons and daughters of God, June 27th. The title is Honesty. 2 Corinthians 8.21 says, Providing for honest things, not only in the sight of the Lord, but also in the sight of men. In all business transactions, we are to let the light shine decidedly. There is to be no sharp practice. Everything is to be done with the strictest integrity. Better consent to lose something financially than to gain a few shillings by sharp practice. We shall lose nothing in the end by fair dealing. We are to live the law of God in our world and perfect a character after the divine similitude. All business with those in the faith and those not in the faith is to be transacted on square righteous principles. Everything is to be seen in the light of God's law Everything done without fraud, without duplicity, without one tinge of guile. For a Babylonish robe and a paltry treasure of gold and silver, Achan consented to sell himself to evil, to bring upon his soul the curse of God, to forfeit his title to a rich possession in Canaan, and lose all prospect of the future immortal inheritance in the earth made new. A fearful price indeed he paid for his ill-gotten gains. Deal honestly and righteously in this present evil world. Some will be honest when they see that honesty will not endanger their worldly interests. But all who act from this principle will have their names blotted out of the book of life. Strict honesty must be cultivated. We can go through the world but once. We cannot come back to rectify any mistakes. Therefore, every move made should be with godly fear and careful consideration. When God makes up his jewels, the true, the frank, the honest will be his chosen ones, his treasures. Angels are preparing crowns for such and light from the throne of God will be reflected in its splendor from these star gemmed diadems. Have a great day. You're a son and daughter of God.